Good morning. It's July 29th, 2022. We're with Denny here at uh, beautiful Token Creek Park at Chandra's Memorial Bench. And today happens to be the 11th anniversary of Chandra's passing. And what a gorgeous day it is here. And it's just good to get together and reflect and wanted to talk to Denny about how things are going and some of his fond memories of Chandra. So Denny, good morning. Good, good to morning. see you. Great to see you. What a beautiful day. Tell us about that book that's in your hand. I was wondering why you brought that. Well, this is, um, this is a journal book that I gave to Chandra um, on the day of her high school graduation. Uh, when I handed it to her as a gift, um, there were several many uh, entries of her uh, childhood memories that I wrote about in this journal book. She took it, read it, uh, embraced it, and then handed it back to me with the command, so Chandra-like, that, Dad, you need to finish this. Um, I got about three quarters of the way through it in terms of pages, and so then I took it back and somehow in the myriad of life things get lost along the roadside and it reappeared to me after her passing so it's a really interesting bit of business that this um, journal book came back to me after her passing and every now and then i pick it up and i write an entry or two in memory of my beautiful daughter so I wanted to bring this along this morning just as a reflection of um, her life and times. Uh, there were many things written in here when I first passed it off to her about her childhood. A lot of great memories, memories of her love for family. It was uh, very intense. Uh, she really, truly loved her family, um, each and every single one of us. It was, um, it was pretty powerful. Uh, there were um, things written in here about her relationship with her grandparents, her relationship with her parents, uh, and her relationship with her brother. And a lot of humorous kinds of entries that um, I wrote in here about. She was a very um, determined young lady growing up. She had her opinions about things. And she wasn't afraid to express them particularly to her dad. And I wrote about all of those kinds of things as, um, as my memory um, was able to bring them together. I also wrote about her. Also wrote about her um, her skills. Um, she was very athletic, and um, one of one of my disappointments is is that I uh, didn't get a chance to spend as much time with her in that arena because I really believe now, as I reflect back, that. Um, she could have been um, a, a special kind of athlete. Um, she had a lot of natural skills. Uh, she played field hockey. Um, she, did a, she did a lot of things uh, like that. And she was an accomplished horseback rider, as I've written about before. She rode English and won many ribbons. So I write about that in the, in the book. I share this with you this morning because it's a reflection of the fact that um, you might lose someone here physically on the face of the earth, but you never lose them. You never, ever, ever lose them uh, because spiritually they stay with you. So I wanted to share that with you this morning. 